Okay, everybody, say hi to Philip. This is my nephew. Philip, say hi. Hi. We are going on a back road bike ride together. We're gonna show you where he goes to school and just the area behind his house. Pretty cool, actually. So, lead the way, Philip. And this is Harley, our crazy dog. He likes to get in everybody's way when he can because he's the center of attention. So what you gotta do with him is you really gotta tell him to keep moving, otherwise he's gonna get in front of your bicycle. All right, Philip, which way is it? This way? Yep. All right, lead the way, brother. Come on, talk about your school. What do you like about your school, Philip? Okay. My you know what I like about your school? What? It's really close to the house. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's yeah, like the backyard pretty much. Like I can drive on <clears> my bicycle all the way to school. Yep. And not even have to be on the road. Oh heck yeah. That's the cool part about it. Also, what? there is a like a baseball field park here. And uh, there's an abandoned tennis court. I don't know why they abandoned that. Let's go show them the tennis court. Do you, you remember how to get there? No. I think you can figure it out. So this here is part of the park. This is not the school yet. The school is a little bit up ahead. Huh? Further? Further, yeah. What's your school called, Philip? Winston Elementary. Wildcats. What's your, who's your principal? Miss yeah. Miss George. Miss George? Yes. It's a female oh, okay. principal? No, a, a woman. A woman principal. Is she nice? No. You have no kind words to say about her? Okay. So, sorry Miss George, you get no kind words. That means you're not doing a very good job here. Anyway, moving on. Going on the road. Going on the road. And, uh, ooh, little Philip here is taking off like crazy. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Not having race, no. So here we are. This is actually Philip's school now here. Um, I left Philip in the dust. Philip, go in front of me. You're the star of the show today. Not you, Harley. Get out of the way. Harley! I know. He wants to be the star. He hates when. Somebody else is the star of the show. Okay. Over here on the right. Okay. Okay. Are you? Do you guys play on this field over here on your left? In school? No. 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 Never. That's for payment. Payment. Pay. You gotta pay. Oh, you got to pay to play, huh? Yep. What kind of park is that? Ah. So this is a school property, you say, huh? Yep. Okay. And this is the main road. Farther, further, there. And then right here. This is a school road, where we go to school. Okay. How we get to school. Now, how do we get to the abandoned tennis court that I've been promising the people? I don't know. Actually, you never saw It's a good thing I know. I did show you once. 
It's this way, but we, we went the long way just now. What we should have done, or could have done, is gone the short way. Oh yeah? How many principles do you have? He's a little boy. Star of attention, huh? Hardly, always a star of attention. Yeah, that's right. They call him Mr. Little Bud. <laughs> Mr. Little Bud. Ah, well, here's um, the batting practice area. And then here's the abandoned tennis court. For some reason, they just stopped upkeeping it. I don't know if you can tell, but it is not playable. You would not want to play tennis on this court. There's too much grass. And... Up, up, up. Grown in grass, basically. They have not kept up on it for a while. I don't know why. It seems like a... Well, I guess I do know why. What do you think about it, Philip? Would you still play tennis on it? Would you still want to play tennis here? They will cut the grass here. It's going to need more than cutting the grass here. No. Look at all the crack, all the cracks in the cement. You don't care about that? Nope. Doesn't bother you none? Nope. But you don't think it would affect the the way the game is played? What? You don't think it would affect the way the game is played? Like say your ball hit the crack and it went the wrong some other way. No, I don't care about that. You don't care about that? Alright. Look, there's a bunch of balls over there too. I already found like four last time. You gotta look. And then you gotta get Harley to go get him. So we just found a ball. Let's look for another one. Philip, find another one. We're gonna make hard to get it. I forgot to press record the last time he got it. And he did it so quickly too. Last time it took him forever to figure out what I'm trying to. Harley found two balls right here. Good job, Harley. Okay. You got any more, Harley? No, the, the, leave those alone, Harley. Go find some new ones. Harley, drop it. Drop it. Drop it, drop it. Good boy. Come on, let's go look for some balls. Come on. Come on, boy. Drop it. Drop. Good. What? Okay. So, Philip, how would you rate this tennis court? One to zero. One zero? From one to zero. I mean, from one to ten. Ten being really cool. One being not cool at all. A two. Brutal. Oh, got another ball, Philip. So Harley drops one, picks up another. You want to grab it? No. Neither do I. He dropped that one too. It's not that nice. I like those yellow or orange or pink ones. There's another one right there in the bushes. No, just simple white. Dirty old.
What would you do if you had a big speed bump? Look ahead, look ahead. Always look ahead when you're going, doing something crazy. Don't look behind you. That's how you fall. Always look ahead, keep your hands firm, grip. Whatever's behind you can wait. Until you stop. I don't know, you tell me. I'm following you. That's a cool bobcat. We need one of these at the house. Well, we don't. We need to get one ASAP. I'm gonna buy one tomorrow. That's it. Have enough money. They got like two hundred bucks. Two hundred bucks? More. More? Yep. Oh, believe me, I have more than two hundred bucks. I'm not gonna buy it on the lawn. Why? That's the fun, that's the whole fun of it. This is why it's called a mud trail, trail bike. So you can go on mud. You put it on the low gear and then just battle through it like a 4x4 four four truck. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? If you pretend that you are, then you can be whatever you want to be, Philip. Ready? Up the hill. Go! He made it!